Happy Halloween. Ah, even a worse mask. Well, we all wear masks sometimes, don't we? It's almost Halloween, Tuesday night. All the ghosts and goblins will be out. So it's Ron Johnson from LTL Tutoring Central, and I'm just making a little video this week to say play safe or trick-or-treat safe. So if you or if your children are going out trick-or-treating Tuesday night, make sure that they can see through their mask or their costume. You don't want to be stumbling around or walk in front of a, a car because you couldn't see it. So you don't have to wear a mask. You can always wear makeup. Uh, but if you are wearing a mask, make sure you can see through it. Obviously, if you're crossing streets, make sure you look both ways. The costume should be brightly colored, or you can use some reflective material to make sure that people can see you on the street, especially wandering around in the dark. And um, go in a group. Uh, go with two or three friends. If your parents aren't coming along with you, make sure you're, you've got three or four people in a group to go trick-or-treating and approach houses that have lights on and maybe have jack-o'-lanterns and things that look like they're ready to receive trick-or-treaters. And don't go to houses that are completely dark. It might uh, feel more spooky and Halloween-like, but it, it might not be the safest thing. Plus, you want to leave people alone who are not really into Halloween. Uh, Halloween is not celebrated uh, all over the world, and not everyone believes in Halloween. Uh, so have fun with it and go to homes that look like they're having fun with it. So that's the safest bet. Don't eat your candy on the street. Take it home, check it over, or have your parents check it over. Uh, and also don't eat all your candy at once. Save some. Delayed gratification is a good lesson to learn. Parents, you can teach your children about delayed gratification. You don't have to have everything now. You can leave something for later. You don't have to be rewarded every five minutes. So that's a good lesson to learn, and then you won't feel sick if you eat too much candy. Uh, if you're an adult, obviously, same tips. You want to be able to see if you're driving, so don't wear a mask or a costume where you can't see, or a costume that's going to trip you up, either walking or when you're driving and you get caught underneath the accelerator or something of that nature. So you too want to play safe, and if you're drinking, don't drive and don't drink too much. Just like eating too much candy, you're not going to feel well later. So have fun and make sure you're going to have fun the next day as well. That's important. I'll put a link to the blog below because there are more tips there and there's a link to even more tips by another organization. And uh, in the meantime, I just want you to have fun with Halloween. Enjoy yourself. Don't overindulge. And uh, don't forget that I'm here to help you with your reading, writing, mathematics and study skills. So give me a call or an email. You can make a comment, you can subscribe to my channel, I would really appreciate that, or like the video, and uh, check out the blog as well. It's Ron Johnson from LTL Tutoring Central. Have a happy Halloween.